Okay, this is part two of the Panasonic scooter build series. I have not made much progress in the last 10 days. Um, I was waiting for the dongles to come in from Jehu. Wasn't sure if he was even ever going to get them. Kept watching and watching and people were asking questions and not getting any response from him. And then finally on a live Q&A, he mentioned uh, the problems he was having ordering them and getting them in. Um, so I went ahead and decided to head the other route. So I went ahead and took all five of my battery packs and cut off the uh, scooter connection, which I wish I would have waited two weeks to do, but I cut off the scooter connection, put on an XD90, and then you can see I created a pigtail here for my five batteries for the XD90. Comes up into my voltmeter. You can see those two batteries that I'm hooked up to now is running 41.1 volts. And I went ahead and tried the dongle device from the other guy. I bought two of them, could not get either one of them to work. It did not come with any instructions or anything on how to wire them. He changed the um, mechanism to this tower design, which is supposed to be a solderless tower design. After figuring it up two or three different ways, couldn't get it working. Um, I finally traced it with my meter and I guess come to find out you've got your positive on one side, your negative on the other, and then your blue wire transmission in the center. I fed that into an XT60 and down and then temporarily hooked it into the blue wires on the batteries. But I can't get anything to work. I bought two of these, $15 a piece, can't get either of them to work. And uh, reached out to the guy, it took me a little trouble getting a hold of him. Apparently he's got multiple emails and multiple uh, ways to contact him or whatnot. He says that the board, the last batch of board that he got has a negative trace issue on the negative side so apparently he's going to replace the two that I bought but in the meantime now Jehu just sent me an email and they've announced that they've got their dongles in and they're getting ready and starting to put them together so I went ahead and ordered from Jehu just in case now that was quite a bit more expensive at $29 for one no sense in getting the four-piece dongle now I'm hoping to be able to wire that one up similar to what I've got here and run all five batteries. Um, the other thing that I've discovered is how am I going to carry this thing around? I've got a bad back. By the time you get five of these together, it's 50 pounds plus your inverter and all your other stuff. So I did get a toolbox, a wheeled toolbox by DeWalt. I ordered this off of Amazon. It was 40 some dollars. Really a quality case. It's got a handle that comes out the front. As you can see, you can wheel it around. And uh, I mounted the battery packs, two on a board. And my plan is to stack them on top of each other. Uh, I've got plenty of room. And uh, that's what I'm going to use. I'll probably, either on the end of the case, or on the front of the case, or maybe even on the top of the case, I'll go ahead and put my meters, my charging on one end, my my output on the other end, and then maybe come up with something similar to my homemade job from last year where I can keep an eye on the voltage, have, have it pass through a buck converter down to 12 volts regulated, and then have some access to it, and then uh, get me a little bit bigger inverter. This is a uh, 300, I believe, or 360 wattage and uh, maybe get a little bit bigger one so that's just an update from here I went ahead and ordered the dongle from Jehu we'll get that one going I guess as a backup I'm hoping the other guys dongles come through and they work this time that's kind of discouraging kind of discouraging that I went ahead and took off all the wires too which I could if I would have just waited two weeks I could have just plugged them in and be good to go. But, uh, you know, in the past I bought three other battery packs from Jehu and he sold them. 
the uh, activation board for the BMS, and then he sold out of them and uh, never got them back again. And I waited and waited and waited, and I'm still waiting, and it's been, what, almost a year, probably nine months. So my fear of not getting a dongle was pretty high, which is why I went the other direction. On an unrelated note, the other battery packs that I've got, these are the Life PO4s. I've been breaking down and reclaiming the cells, and I've got an additional video showing you that, so I'm almost done. And my plan there is to build a uh, another PO4 24 volt battery with those. So that's an update for here for now. Uh, hopefully uh, the next one I'll have even better news for you. Uh, I'll put the links below to the uh, some of the products that I use, the, the toolbox and that. Thanks for watching.